Thanks for joining us. It could have made for quite a tailgate, but instead nearly 2,000 cases of beer were thrown out. Gary Sinderson is live for us in our Center County newsroom with more on why this beer just could not be sold, Gary. And Jen, we can tell you this is a story about mass quantities of alcohol. It has nothing to do with student move-in days here at Penn State. But imagine this is your day at work and entails destroying more than 4,300 gallons of beer, perfectly good beer. That was a work assignment for some employees here in Center County after they got the cleanup call after a beer truck crashed on Interstate 80. Our story takes place at the Center County Solid Waste Authority headquarters. Uh, from time to time, we do have accidents on Interstate 80, and we have insurance companies contact us requiring us to destroy a product that's being transported that's been in an accident. Take a closer look. All that metal package behind them is crushed beer cans. Old Milwaukee, more than 2,000 cases delivered to the authority from the beer truck crash. Here's some photos provided to us by the authority. 12 hours after delivery, the cans are crushed and all that beer poured down the drain. It definitely was a sad day for a lot of the employees around here to have to see so much of that go down the drain. Plus, all the machinery involved had to be hosed down and cleaned so the workplace didn't smell like a brewery. So again, more than 4,300 gallons of beer destroyed at the Center County Solid Waste Authority this week. By the way, all those crushed cans, they'll be resold and recycling. Probably the authority will make about $4,000 in revenue. We're live in Center County. Gary Sanderson, 6 News.